so this year facebook is celebrating its 20 year anniversary which to start off with is pretty crazy Mm -hmm. um but something that i thought was very interesting was that people are still signing up to facebook 20 years on so i was quite surprised when i heard this news um I thought that if you aren't on Facebook now, you would never be. Um, But yeah, it's quite an interesting development that they are still finding more and more users on the platform. That's mad. It's mad that. Yeah, I was quite surprised when you said it as well, because I guess like it it still happens. Right. But were there any numbers of how many people are joining these days or anything like that? So it's quite an interesting one. If I give me one second. Sorry, sorry. Let me just reverse my bus back a little bit let you (laughs) find this article so so at the last count facebook has over three billion monthly active users so across the globe basically stats show that if you can access facebook then you will wow so the majority of people in countries where facebook is available to them are on facebook or as these new stats show signing up which is pretty crazy. That is mad. That is mad. What What do you think the reason for that is? Well, yeah, we were talking earlier about why people might still be joining. And I guess from our perspective, you might be joining for work because if you don't have a personal Facebook, then you can't access like company accounts or if you set up your own business, um, you need your personal Facebook in order to set up a Facebook page for your own business. So I guess maybe it could be people like that um or that's a I lot wonder- of digital marketing people is yeah <laughs> i wonder if it's also maybe the older population like my gran is on facebook is she yeah she's 92 so shout out to my gran and she's on facebook so i wonder if it's people of that generation who want to connect maybe with their grandchildren um and they're finding these new ways still um of connecting with them because mm-hmm. it's I guess I speak to my grandparents and my partner does as well via email. And I guess social media gives that extra element of keeping up with the latest pictures and updates and things like that. It's just that little bit more personal than sending emails once a month, isn't it? Right. Yeah. And again, I think when I moved out, my mum was like, oh, I need to get Instagram because that seems to be where you all are. And that's where I can see the photos of the grandchildren or of the kids. Or um, So I wonder whether it's that kind of the kids who are on socials are moving out or moving away. So the older generations want to kind of keep up, keep in touch. And it's where we're all sharing our photos, isn't it? So. For sure. For sure. I think as well, there are some apps which you need Facebook to log into or mm-hmm. it really helps you to log in. I can't think of any off the top of my head, which is really frustrating. I know the ones you mean where it's like sign up through Facebook and that is the easiest way yeah. for you because it just has all your data already. For sure. Um, yeah, so I can imagine maybe there's people are noticing there's that option on more and more websites and they're going for that. For sure. 